नमस्कार दोस्तों सो और फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन अनप्लान मेट्रो प्रोजेक्ट्स सो अनप्लान मेट्रो प्रोजेक्ट्स इन सिटीज पोज मोर प्रॉब्लम देन द सॉल्यूशन दे ऑफर इन द लाइट ऑफ दिस ऑफ द स्टेटमेंट एवलविट हाउ मेट्रो रेल पॉलिसी 2017 एड्रेस एड्रेसेस दिस प्रॉब्लम अनप्लान मेट्रो रेल प्रोजेक्ट मेनली इन सिटीज मेनली अनप्लान इट इज एंड इट इज मेनली रिलेटेड इट इज मेनली here you can see some of the important problem and problems more solve problems than solution they offer so in the light of this uh, statement evaluate your answer metro rail policy address this problem mainly problem and if there is solution your solution so our answer is the solvent features of this policy that one is the make makes ppp private public private partnership component mandatory for availing central assistance on metro projects makes ppp component mandatory for availing central assistance on on metro projects and mandates alternative analysis requiring evaluation of other modes of mass tran transit like brts bus rapid transit system and light rail transit and tramway system and metro rail and regional rail in terms of demand capacity cost and easy of easy of implementation so we can take some of the important alternative analysis we can take like BR, brts means a bus rapid transit system light transit tramway metro rail and regional rail in terms of the demand and capacity cost capacity cost and easy of implementation and mandatory to set up the urban metro metropolitan transport authority okay urban aumt urban metropolitan transport authority this authority will prepare comprehensive mobile mobility plans so urban metropolitan transport authority this authority will prepare a compre comprehensive mobile plan mobility plans and for cities uh, for ensuring a complete multimodal integration for optimal utilization of capacity so what we can take important steps so mandatory to set up urban time metropolitan transport authority umta and this authority will prepare comprehensive mobility plans for cities and for ensuring complete complete a multimodal integration for optimal utilization of capacities and third party assessment of metro rail projects stipulates uh, to achieved from present from the present financial internal rate so here third party assessment of metro rail proposal and stipulates a stay saved from the present financial internal rate of return of 8 percent to economic internal rate of return 14 percent for approving metro projects so please remember so stipulates a saved from the present financial like internal rate it is return of 8 8 percent so economic internal rate of return 14 percent for approving metro projects value capture and financing tools to mobilize resources value capture financing tools and to mobilize resources uh, for financing metro projects uh, by capturing a share of increase in the asset value through to betterment levy so value capture financing tools we can use and to mobilize resources okay and important it is resources for financing metro projects by capturing a share of increase in the asset values increase the asset value through betterment levy and to ensure to ensure financial validity viability it seeks it asks state to clearly indicates the measures to be taken for commercial and property development at, at station and on other urban land and for means of maximum non fair revenue generation through uh, to advertisement lease of space and back by statutory support to ensure financial viability it, it asks the states to clearly indicate the measures to be taken for commercial and property development as a development at situation at stations uh, okay commercial property development at station and on, on other urban land and for, for other means of so maximum non-fair revenue non-fair revenue generation through advertisement lease of space and backup backed by statutory support 
is how to uh, it helps so it helps in the LPPP model uh, private, private public and partnership model so it is mainly reduces the burden of the government on the government so it reduces the burden on the government in uh, funding metro projects it reduces the chances for project being stalled so it reduces what reduces the chances of project being stalled by mandating establishment and authority it reduces the chance for project being installed for mandating establishment and authority it reduces the risk of in funding it reduces the risk in funding and by, by mandating plan assessment so it reduces the risk of fund, risk in funding risk in funding by mandating plan assessment Okay, mandating plan assessment. So please remember it is important. So it is mainly unplanned metro rail projects. So it reduces pose more problem than in the solution of the offer. In the light of this statement, evaluate and metro evaluate how metro rail policy yeah, 2017 addresses this problem. Okay, please remember and please send this answer. So thank you.